Hey guys, what's up? I'm back with some more game playing. Uh, today I'm gonna be playing a uh, custom made Minecraft map and uh, resource pack. It's actually based on a game on Steam that's called The Stanley Parable. And this is actually what this is directly called too, is The Stanley Parable. And uh, it's gonna be kind of interesting. I've never actually played The Stanley Parable on Steam, so this kind of give me a taste of what it's like. And uh, I'm actually going to do something a little different too. It's uh, I'm going to be playing at the same time, but you guys are actually going to be able to choose which path I take. And you'll see how that's done here in a little bit. But it's just going to be interesting. Let's go ahead and start here. This is the story of a man named Stanley. Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Employee number 427's job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on a keyboard. Orders came to him through a monitor on his desk, telling him what buttons to push, how long to push them, and in what order. This is what employee 427 did every day of every month of every year. And although others might have considered it soul rending, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came in as though he had been made exactly for this job. And Stanley was happy. Okay, here we are. My office, I guess. And then one day, something very peculiar happened. Something that would forever change Stanley. Something he would never quite forget. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for him to follow. No one had showed up to give him instructions, call a meeting, or even say hi. Never in all his years at the company had this happened, this complete isolation. Something was very clearly wrong. Shocked, frozen solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, he got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room to check on his co-workers. He never functioned well by himself and constantly needed support and guidance from others, so the thought of total solitude was terrifying to him. Okay, I guess we're heading to the meeting room. I'm guessing these are more offices. I got the best office, apparently, because mine's completely secluded from everybody else. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Alright, so which one should I enter? 